Hey guys, so I'm going to walk you through setting up the Club Sport pedal install. So first off, open up your kit um, that I sent you. Um, this is a US kit, so it includes the oil. Um, this is your shock assembly with both brackets kind of lightly mounted. The blue heavier spring. Your Allen key. And both valve, the extra valves. So one's a one hole and then one's a three hole. And then finally we have the uh, foam insert that goes in the piggyback. Okay, the, uh, the next step is to remove the knob. So you want to apply pressure pulling it straight up until it pops off. Then grab a set of pliers and loosen the, the nut that's currently holding the brake adjuster knob. Remove the, uh, the nut and the washer from it. Um, once that's clear, you want to push the knob down through the bracket so that it's floating freely. The next step is to loosen the upper bracket and the lower bracket from the shock mount. Um, you just want to set these aside for now because you're going to use these separately. Um, so loosen the top and loosen the bottom and pull it free of the shock. And then once that's done, you're going to just set your shock absorber aside and grab your bracket. Um, you're going to slip the bracket over the metal bracket. Um, it's a snug fit, so you got to apply some pressure to do it. You want to fit the bracket into the groove of the plastic bracket I'm sending you, and then push it forward until it slips into place. Then just align your holes so that you can then slip your brake uh, adjuster uh, back through it. Then slip your the washer and the, uh, the nut for the brake adjuster knob back on and tighten it back down. Once it's hand tightened, then grab your set of pliers and then tighten it the rest of the way so it's nice and snug. And then once that's done, just grab your knob, line up the groove for the slot of the knob with the slot of the brake adjuster and then push it back down into place. So once that's done, you want to apply the upper bracket, which is plugged into the fourth hole from the bottom. Um, once you've got that done, take your shock absorber and slip the lower bolt through the lower bracket and the upper bolt through the upper bracket. You just need to compress it a little to do that. Uh, finally, take the nut in the washer and just hand tighten the lower bracket in place. Uh, you'll just want to get it loose for now so that you don't have it popping out when you're doing the upper part. Then uh, once you've got that in place, you want to flip your pedals over, and this part's kind of difficult to see because it's a very tight quarters, but you want to kind of do the same thing with the top bracket. Slip a washer on it and then hand tighten it down so that you can uh, you can get that in place. Um, on the top one, I just do it, you know, try to get it as snug as possible. Uh, it's pretty hard to get a wrench in there. Uh, you could probably use a set of needle nose pliers and get it, but just grab your Allen key and you know, place your thumb or something on the on the nut so that you can hold it in place and then just tighten it down. So the last step is just going to be flipping your pedals back over. Um, press on your brake pedal a few times to make sure that everything moves cleanly, um, that it doesn't get hung up on anything. Um, and then once that's good, take your pair of pliers and your Allen key and then just proceed to tighten down that bolt the rest of the way so it's nice and snug. Um, once you've done that, you are uh, pretty much set to go. So I uh, hope you guys like your kit. Thanks.